welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to make slime. But before we get started, hit that subscribe button, turn notification bell, and give me a huge thumbs up. Today I'm going to be making slime, like I said. So what I'll be needing is some, a couple bottles of clear glue, maybe some glitter, some mixing spoons, some hot water, some borax, some food color, some shaving foam, like these little measuring cups, and a bowl. So let's get started. First, we're gonna add our clear glue. So let's add. We're gonna untwist the top. Oh, it's coming out really slow. Sorry. <laughs> so, um, basically what I'm doing is I'm making um, a batch of clear slime today um, with some food coloring. Um, and it's kind of going to be like a fluffy slime and like a clear slime. At the same time, that's going to make it just like opaque. So, I'm very excited today because... It's my first time making slime by myself. Um, I've made slime a couple of times. It's very fun. Basically, all you need is glue and activator. Activator can be borax. It can be saline solution with um, borax in it and um, baking soda. But baking soda doesn't like do it. You have to um, do a, activate it by itself. You have to add something with it. Okay. Okay, second bottle was done. I think I'm going to do four because I like big slimes. <laughs> um, I'm just adding in my clear glue right now. I'm using these mini bottles I got in some slime kits. It didn't work, the directions. So I was like, why don't I wing it today? And I'll use one more bottle. So while I'm adding this, I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. I'm probably going to add, sorry, <laughs> um, I'm probably going to add some shaving foam next. Put those aside. Okay, we've got the shaving foam open. Sorry, something fell. Oh, I forgot to shake it. Shake it, shake it. I didn't shake it enough. So while I'm shaking this, I'm just gonna add some food coloring. Once I've done adding this. That's probably enough. We're gonna take our spoon and just mix. So now it's done. Not done done, but like done adding the shaving foam. Next, we're gonna add food coloring. I think I'm gonna do green. I have some green. I'll do one drop. I think I've done green in the past, but then I added too much and it stained my hands. So I'm only adding one drop today. Right now, it's just like a light opaque green. And that's how I wanted it to be. Because I've watched a lot of tutorials on how to do this. Because usually we follow directions, but then those don't work. So here's what the slime looks like right now. Oh, there goes the spoon. <laughs> I think we're going to use a different spoon since I dropped that in. Okay, so, so now that since we've done that, I'm going to add, so we've mixed all this up. Let's, now we've added this, this the food dye and the glue and the shaving foam. Just going to give it a mix. Perfect. 
Um, and now we're going to need some hot water. So, um, let's get some hot water. So, I am going to get some hot water. I'm going to ask my mom to get me some hot water. Here, Mom. Can you get me some hot water, please? Sure. So, now that we've done that, our slime is um, just like a light green color. I'm mixing it because there's still like a little bit of shaving foam that needs to be mixed in. Um, it takes a long time for our water to get like hot, so I might be talking for a while. But we're gonna, with that hot water, all warm, we're gonna add some wax in, which I'm gonna also ask my mom to do because I'm just gonna pour that whole thing out. Um, that's about it. I'm just gonna, I'm, I just used one drop of food coloring because I just, when that happened, when it stained my hands, I was just furious, I was mad. My hands were stained green for like a week. And I dropped the spoon in, so I'm using a different spoon right now. You only need like a spoon for that, like a little bit. Okay, I've got my little bowl of borax. I'm gonna add like a pinch in. Or two. I'm gonna let that dissolve. So now, while we're letting it dissolve, I'm going to tell you what you'll be needing some clear glue to make this. You'll be needing regular original foam, um, shaving foam. Just some original food dye. Food dye is really optional. If you want a white slime, you can make a white slime or a clear slime by itself. So I think that's almost dissolved. I'm going to give it a little mix. When you're doing this, make sure, like, don't eat anything. Do not eat anything. Oh, okay, so the borax is almost dissolved. It has to dissolve a little more. Oh, and by the way, when you're activating slime, you want to do a little bit at a time. And if you want a little slime, you could do a little bit of glue. But if you want a big slime, you can do a little, like, a big amount of glue like I did here. I used all of my... Um, glue up. But since, okay, I'm going to try getting a little bit of glue out these bottles because there's a lot in here. Well, that's how much it gave me. <laughs> um, slime is fun for making for like friends and like friends can even help you because it's really fun because it's a really, it's kind of like a science experiment. Um, it's fun. It's not dangerous. And, oh, our borax is done. Okay, we're pouring in a little bit at a time. So like that much at a time. So like a drop at a time. Oh, it's already starting to come together. And the shaving foam actually helps with activating. It just makes it like more loosened up. I'm adding one drop at a time, so because clear glue, clear glue can get overactivated way too quick. And just add a little more. Okay, it's starting to come together. It's when it's getting off the sides, which it is right here. It's kind of becoming slime. That means you can almost add your hands in. So I'm gonna add a little bit of more. Um, so borax sometimes doesn't work, um, a lot because sometimes I added, um, cold water instead of hot water like I did, um, today because hot, cold water doesn't make it dissolve as quickly. So it makes it like cold and cold, like makes it like all like not stretchy and stuff. And I'm going to try to make this slime stretchy and that's exactly why I used hot water. So we tried making it hot and that actually worked. I'm gonna add a little bit more of my borax. Don't pour all of it in at the same time because then it'll just be a ball. And if you over activate it, it's just gonna be really stiff. 
I think it's coming off the side so I can finally put my hands in. Oh, it feels weird. Okay, we're gonna add some activator. Ooh, that's nice and warm. Just gonna mix it in. See, it's coming off the sides and it's really stretchy. It's um really stretchy because I didn't I did it I added the right amount of shaving foam. Oh wow, this is already ten minutes I've been talking. Well, see, it's coming off the sides of the bowl, and it's just like a light green, like I wanted it because I don't like dark shades. I'll probably pour some in my hands so we can start getting off my hands. When you think your slime is ready and it's just way too sticky and you think you've added enough activator, just start kneading it. Like here, I'm kneading it. But you don't want to do both hands um, in at a time because then you'll just get stuck. So I'm going to add in some more activator. Borax is actually not the worst activator to use, but I do recommend saline solution and borax, um, and not borax, um, and baking soda because that's the best because it makes your slime more stretchy. But I really think I'm doing good with this borax right here. When I always tried it, it would always turn into a ball because we added cold water. And the slime is finally coming together. I just have to keep on kneading it more. It's kind of like an arm oh workout. So, I think I'm done with the slime. So, here we go. This is actually a very good neat slime if, you want, if you're bored and you want to do a science experiment. It's also really fun because these are just like ingredients you can find around the house, like some school glue and then some borax or activator because you might use that to wash your clothes because that's really just like something you can do for laundry. And finally coming off the bowl, so I'm gonna add the rest of the activator. We did this whole thing of activator because it's just like, really not coming together. Well, this is actually coming together. It just needs a need. Well, I'm going to end the video here. Bye. Before I end it, make sure to hit that subscribe button, turn notification bell, and give me a huge thumbs up. Make sure, and make sure to follow these steps and make your, your own slime. So, bye-bye.